everybody. Welcome back for another episode of My Time at Portia. As you know, the last episode we had the ghost run and I did not do well. At all. At all. I never do. It's nothing new for me. Alright, let's go grab our goody goodness. And this, and this, and that, and this, and we'll harvest these. These are not ready. Okay, um, I can make the two. I can make two of those. Okay, so let's put you and you and you and put you down here. And put your rubber tires wherever it goes. Okay. Let me grab my horse, you horse. Of course, of course. We do our um, inspections. I swear, if Gus makes me walk that piggy again today, I'm gonna be angry. All right, that looks fine. Um, a little bumpy there. That. And here. Oh my gosh, these big ones. This is not going to go well. I can see nothing wrong. Oh my goodness. It's too big. Why would they, why would they do that? All right, there. So oh my goodness, this, this, this. I don't know what the next one is. Let's look over here. Nothing. I got nothing, guys. I don't know. I can't find anything. Oh, my gosh. I don't know. I'm sure I'm just not seeing it. I have no idea. Looks like we're going to not get this one. I don't know. I can't see anything that's wrong. Okay. Um, that was coming anyways because I couldn't find it. Great. Just great. Mm 
Anything on the bottom? Nope. <laughs> what in the crap? I see nothing. Any ankle. That was, I don't know, that was just a click. All right. That's obvious. That's obvious. That's obvious. Oh my goodness. Hello, oh. smallish builder. Come here. Come on. We must discuss a matter of manly importance. Sure. I've got time to chat. Great news. That's great news. You see, when I was training my body yesterday, Mars told me about a small group of warriors from Seaside who make their fists strong by punching trees. <laughs> I said to myself, that's the manliest thing I've ever heard. I must try it. And believe me, smallish builder, I did. Those trees felt my mighty hands. Cocoons and rubber fruit were falling everywhere. <laughs> but my fists could not keep up with my manly spirit. Today they're all <laughs> swollen and I can't do the fine detail work that makes my furniture truly great. Well, there you go. Not all hammers and saws, my little friend. This furniture takes a keen eye and quick fingers. In a few days I have a client coming from Sandrock to pick up some tea tables. But these hands are probably going to be smashed up for a while. Is there any chance you can make them? Of course I can. I like your confidence. Listen here, smallish friend. A man like me does not ask for someone to do his work as a favor. I'll give you the full payment from the client in return. Sounds good, dude. All right. Let's go ahead and learn that. Ah, uh, come here, horsey. Let's go ahead and recover this horse. And Petra. Petra. There you are. Hi. If you find anything of value from the old world, please donate it to us. You have no idea how much a discovery can change the world. Don't listen to what the church has to say. We just want to progress towards a better world. Hi, did you discover something new? That should be enough data disks. Still, if you want to expedite our research, you can I submit have more data disks. The more data, the faster we work. Do I have enough? You don't have enough data disks. That should be enough data disks. <sighs> Still, if you want to... The data corruption on okay, these disks so. are minimal. There should be useful info on them. We'll have something for you by tomorrow. Oh, that's better than not being able to speed it up at all. Alright, so we've got that going on. Let me see. What else do we need to do? Alright, so we are going to go over here and find this quest. Arlo. Oh, hey. Want to join me on a run? Oh, God, no. Yes. Great. Let's go. Shoot. Let's go, Arlo. Am I just running? Hold on. Where's the... Oh, my gosh. Where am I? Okay. All right. So, we're going to run this way, Arlo. Yes. Yeah, so let's get our cardio up. Sorry, I don't have my stuff because I'm a Dingledorf. Okay. Is this all? No. 
That better not be all of the freaking... Oh my god, are you kidding me? Alright, let's go up here to the pea farm. Good gravy. Where are you, Arlo? Come on. Why can't I use my horse? After this, you look really tired. Probably need to exercise more. Thanks. <gasps> hey, Arlo. Is this your usual exercise routine? Or are you training for an event? Glad you asked. I'm training to join the best adventure guild in the land. The Flying Pigs. Their entrance exam is notoriously difficult. So I must prepare myself for the next opportunity. Thanks for accompanying me. I'll go for a few more laps and then finish up for the day. Good gravy. Kids these days. Add it? Something the matter? Kids can be so cruel. Some migrating birds came to our farm. Old friends of mine, as a matter of fact. They'd been roosting peacefully for a few days until yesterday. A couple of kids thought it'd be fun to shoot them with a slingshot. Luckily, none of them were killed, but I had my hands full nurturing the ones that were hit back to health. I scolded those kids, but I'm afraid they have no reason to listen to me. Do you think you could get through to them? Maybe build me something to shoot at so they'll leave my birds alone. Maybe build them something to shoot at so they'll leave my birds alone. Sure thing. I knew I could count on you. I've never made something like that before, but I'll try my best. Django's Gaming Hall has a dart game. Maybe you could u make something similar. All right. I'll go see if Django knows anything. Mm, all right. Dang it. Dang it. Doodly doo doo doos. Alright. You go, Django. Teach me something, son. Teach me something. The dark game? Ah, yes. I was inspired by one of the many flea markets of Walnut Groove. You could find anything there. Statues of cool night stuff, little nutcrackers that would dance in the palm of your hand. The air smelled of cotton candy and the towels were oh so fluffy. I love going to flea markets. Mm. Makes me want to go. That's great and all, but I just want to know how I can make one myself. Seems like quite a complex contraption, eh? <laughs> this may come as a bit of a surprise to you, but that particular dark game was constructed entirely by none other than yours truly. In fact, I suppose I could make something like that for you. It won't be free, right? Do you take me for some goals-hungry swan? Anat has no need for the mama's accumulation of currency. However, according to our code, one should not expect something without an offering in return either. Make me a shell necklace for my friend, and I'll make you a dark game. I think I can handle that. <sighs> So much to do, and I love it. All right, anybody else before I leave town? Oh yeah, Emily. Okay, okay. Emily. Oh, it's not Emily, it's Nora. I went over to the Ufala Desert the other day. It was so hot. When I came here from Atara, the road went around the desert. Oh, hello. Well, I'm sorry we weren't at the plaza today. Ali is unwell, you see. He is at home with fever. Oh, no. I'm sad to hear that. I hope he gets better soon. Is there anything I can help you with in the meantime? There is one thing, in fact. A thing Lee asked me to do. Lee asked me to deliver these care packages. He has been secretly aiding those in need since he doesn't want to embarrass them in front of the whole town. 
That's awfully kind of him. I hope you can go with me. I'm worried about someone will come to rob these packages. Let them come. Do I have any of my gifts or did I put... Yeah, dippity doop. Alright, let's go, Nora, Nora. I'm going to take my handy steed. Nora. Nora. Okay, let's see where we need to deliver these packages to. Everywhere. Wonderful. Okay, well, hang on tight. Um, hmm. Let's go back down. Okay. Back down here. Um, Sonia? No way. It's gotta be Alice. Thank you. Everyone in Portia is so kind. I'm so glad me and Jack ended up here. I'm glad I ended up here as well. Anyway, I hope your business gets better soon. Please, take this as a thank you. Oh, Alice, you break my heart, sister. All right. Pressing. Mars and Carol. Thank you so much, Nora. This will really help us out. The church is glad to help. I feel so bad relying on your kindness, but it's so hard to provide for three daughters. Just make sure you follow the budget next time. And we don't have to rely on the church. But it's too strict. Life can't always be about work. We need to have fun, too. Aww. That's sad. And he's right. He is absolutely right. Alright, so the next one... Oh, of course, it's Papa, Papa Bear. And my little oaks. Thank you, Nora. You know I will pay you back once I get a job. No need, Oaks. It is a gift. The church is happy to help everyone. Thank you for helping me. Remember to keep this a secret. Doesn't Lee want everyone to know the good work <laughs> the church is doing? Minister Lee doesn't want the people in need to feel bad about getting aid from the church. So... Can you please keep quiet about it? I'll keep my mouth shut. Darn tootin'. Alright, anything else? What is that up here? Alright, I wanted to see... Drill saw machine to drill. Make some tea tables. Bullseye. What is that up there though? Is this some place I had to go? Good. You're recovering well and should be good to go. Oh. But I'm still having headaches, Doctor. For the headache, use the medicine from last time for a few more days. Things should be fine. Okay, but I still feel my heart beating really, really fast. Uh. Heart still beats fast? Did you rest well? Working too hard at the Commerce Guild? Make sure you get enough rest. Okay, you are the boss. Hey there. Strange, you should be fine with these medicine. Why are you still sick? What else could it possibly be? Yeah, it could be some new disease. 
pay attention to it. Could his condition be related to his mood? Mood? I don't really know then. Wish I had learned more at Seasai. But I was young and foolish, so I left when I thought I had already learned everything there was to learn. Oh, by the way, here's a task for you. In the next few days, my teacher will send some medical books and magazines to Wuwa by sea. Can you ask him about it for me? Let me know if it has arrived. Sure. Thank you. Hi. How are you doing, man? Uh, I lost track of time again, but I got everything ready ahead of schedule. Okay. I don't have even your stuff right now. Antoine. Hmm. We need to figure out what's going on with Antoine. I have a sneaking suspicion. Alright. Let's go down here. My stuff should be more than ready. Um, I've got to make three of those. One of those. And... Oh, steel frame. And one of those. And then I have two, so just one. Okay. Let's put this galloping doo -doo 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 horse right here. Um, pick those up. Um, hmm. Where do the things I just... Oh, dirt. Nope. I just can't see today. Toy robot. Wow. I need to put that in my house. Let's move the poo and put this down here. Okay, well. Let's put these in. And what else do we need? Large drill tip and the industrial engine. With the large drill tip, I must have put away. Um, let me put this in my house before I accidentally stuff the robot somewhere where it don't need to be. Let's put it. Can we put it up on there? No. Let's put it there. Um, anything else I need to put up in here? Ugh, no. Okay. Alright, so the drill tip. And industrial engine. Was it advanced? Um, advanced engine, what can I say? I don't remember. No, it was industrial. Alright, industrial engine, goofy girl. I think they're blue and white. Okay. Um, can I buy that? Is that the one that you can... What is this? No, Arlo. I don't want to run right now. Industrial engine. Can you buy that here? 
I think that's the advanced. Oh no. Fiddle faddle. Hazardous runes. Dag nabbit. I suppose you have anything like that here, do you? The Nova Sword. What is this one? That's 200. That's nice. Alright, well. Okay. All right. Well. Anyways. We're doing what we can. Let's put these guys back for now. Not in the gifts. Sort all. Well, it's two. Put these in there. These lining is artifacts. You don't need to be in there. You do. You can put those in there. See, I've got, oh, I've got so much to do. I'm going to need that on me. All right, well, let's go give Polly these to get that done. This is good work. Wood is sanded <clears throat> smooth. The legs are even. You keep this up, you could catch up to me one day. Here's your pay. But listen, while you're working on this, I got to thinking. Those people from Sandrock, they sure do love their desert tea. I hate the stuff myself. Tea is the least manly drink in the world. <laughs> no, it's not. Then I had an epiphany. What if I make the tea more manly myself? Tea can't resist my strong will. <laughs> I'm not good at preparing food, so can you help me with this thought? Add chili pepper to a tea of your choice and see what happens. Sure. Sure. All right. Good gravy. I don't have any of my gifts on me. Goofy Arlo. Glad you can make it. Let's go. Dad, nab it. All right, well, let's run over here. Come on. So far. Back up to the tree farm? No, to the end of the road. Let's go. I should get on my horse. <laughs> but that would be cheating. We need to exercise our little legs. Do it, do it, do it. Hey, you teleported. That's cheating. You seem very capable already, Arlo. Are you sure you need to push yourself so hard? Yeah, I'm sure. I've not told anyone about this, but the reason I'm training so hard is because I've failed the entrance exam several times already. I'm training for the next time. I cannot fail again this time, so I must train harder. Mm. Just from two days of running, you look tougher already. I'll be here, training every day for the week. So feel free to join me again whenever you're free. Good gravy. Mm. 
We have wasted our freaking day. Alright, um, uh, what is my inventory? Let's go. Let's go. Ooh, hold on. No. Did it say? No. We're gonna go up here. And we are going to reset it. Yes, I know. My bird is just freaking going crazy chirping. I love my bird, but I'm, I've been kind of thinking about getting rid of my bird. Just head Sylvester for, I don't know, probably three, four years. And it breaks my heart to think about getting rid of him, but... So loud, and I've got all this going on with my daughter. He needs a messy. Birds are messy. It's not his fault. It's just they're messy. Um, it's a lot to think about because your animals become like family. Love this birdie, and it, it'd probably take me 50 forevers to even find anyone that I thought would be good enough to take my bird. I don't know. I don't know. All right, let's try this. I know I'm not going to get an engine in here, but... I will take these. Engine. Please, industrial engine. Not a small... I don't know about getting rid of my bird. I don't know. He's a uh, a budgie. He's a sweet bird. I can't touch him. We made it a rule because my daughter has always been not so gentle with animals. We made it a general rule in the house that we just don't touch the bird. We leave the bird alone and. He's happy and we're happy most of the time, but, you know, birds like him, he craves attention all the time, and my attention is solely on my daughter. I do not have time for anything else. We are homeschooling, so I spend my mornings with her, homeschooling her to the best of my ability. and. She gets really frustrated easy. She also has um, oppositional defiant disorder along with ADHD as well. So she can be, whoa, she can be a handful. When she wants to do something, that's great. When she doesn't, you best believe it is not gonna happen. I mean, it's literally a fight. So, I just don't have time. I don't have time. And we have her kitty cat, which is a calico. And, um, there's our industrial engine. And it's a good kitty cat. But we had her for just a little over a year. And she is rambunctious and... She's a handful in herself. 
constantly just come streaking through the house, run and jump up on something, knock stuff over, break stuff. Um, she's a little wild. And then I also have a uh, rescue dog. She is a, let me see what, I can't remember what they called her. I've had her for about four years. Um, what is she called? I don't remember. She is a mix between a your oh, she's a Yorkie Poo. She's a poodle and a Yorkie. Absolutely adorable. But, um, she was in a puppy mill, so she is, um, she needs special attention a lot. And I got all this going on with my daughter, and it's just really hard. It's really hard for me to, um, do the things I need to do. It really is. All right, so we assembled the drill. We need to go place those other things. Let's go take this back. I just have a very, very hectic life. And I am my former life. <laughs> I can't believe you got this built. You must have used some dark magic, eh? <laughs> You're one heck of a builder. I was a hairdresser. Um, pretty successful hairdresser, actually. And, um, I had to give it all up. I had to give it all up for her, which I, that doesn't affect me. I would do it in a skinny minute. But, now I stay home and take care of her and take care of the house the best I can anyways. And it's just, it's a lot. It's a lot to do. And I've always enjoyed playing games. Um, I started out just watching videos on YouTube. And then I was like, you know what? I play these games. Why can't I just make my own videos? And if something comes of it, that's great. And if not, I'm still just going to play my videos, so it's not a big deal. I don't know. We'll see. Man, that's a beautiful sight. Yes, it is. There will be no more sand on my breakfast table. <laughs> Poor Hulu brother. A worker's hat. Let's see what that is. Now, this one is 150 HP. I don't think you're going to top that. Oh, wait. Okay. Thank you. Are you freaking serious? 320? Um, yeah. We will definitely swap those out for sure. Okay. So that is done. Um. We've got to do, basically, we have aluminum, we have the things we need, we just don't have that electric furnace to make the aluminum bars, so we're kind of at a standstill. I'm going to chop these trees. But anyways, yeah, that's that's my story. And you know, like I said, there's all these professional YouTubers out there that are great and play all these action packed games. Not me. When my little girl is sitting here quiet and good, I'll get on here and I'll play. You may hear her in the background, you may hear my birds chirping. You may hear my cat knocking things over. It's, it's fine with me. It's my life. It's not gonna change. 
even if I was one of the most successful YouTubers there is, it's not going to change. Unless my life changes drastically, none of this is going to change. My daughter will always be sitting beside me. You're probably always going to hear her little mama. Now I'm sure I could take the time to edit all this out and all that, but I'm not going to right now. Just not going to. We're going to just do our thing like we've been doing. And that's it. Did I get most of the... Oh. My little pup, you're going to hear her bark when she hears the wind blow, too. Lucy, it's okay, baby. Eh, quit. Alright, so that's pretty much all of those. I do need to get that tree seed, though. Forgot I even had that. Uh, where did I put it? Right here. Nitro tree. Go ahead and grab that fertilizer. Um, and we're almost done with summer. <coughs> so. Oh. Wait a minute. Oh, wow. All right, so it will be autumn. Maybe I'll wait. Gotta remember Alice's birthday. Let's see, when does this all season? So that doesn't matter. I'm gonna go ahead and plant that tree. But as far as my crops, I may just wait. Go ahead and fertilize all of them though. Lucy baby, it's okay. This poor little dog guys, oh my God. She has been treated so bad her whole life. She was born and raised in a puppy mill. She ended up having, they're, they're guessing around, I don't know, six litters of puppies. I don't know, that's a lot to have the babies like that and then have them taken away. And she apparently was kept in a cage the entire time. Um, and her tail, her little tail had rotted off. So they had to dock it. And it's just like a little nub now. I mean, it's not even like a, like a Doberman's, you know. It is a, just a, almost like a, just a little hump. There's not much of a tail at all. Um, and she's scared of everything. You can't, you can't touch her hardly at all. I can. But nobody, nobody else can. You can't, you can't really do anything with her. Even when I have friends or whatever over, she hates everyone instantly. <laughs> she's just, she's just that way. I mean, and you can't blame her. It is not her fault. None of that is her fault. Poor thing. All right, spicy tea, shell necklace. Dr. Seuss book. Okay, so the shell necklace, didn't I make one? I must have put it in here. It is not in with the gifts. Hmm. Two of them. 
Okay, and the tea. I don't know how to do tea yet, do I? Oh, there's that. Chili pepper and tea in a cream set. You can get tea at the farm store. Okay, okay, I gotcha. Talk to Rula at the dock. I'm sure he's not out there now. Hey, Ginger. Sorry, nobody got gifts today. I'm a slacker on the social aspect of this game. Always have been. Perfect. This is what he likes. This is what he likes. Hmm. Now, who could Janko be making a shell necklace for? Toby? That's about the only one I see him with all the time. Oh, right. As promised. A target and darts. Looks perfect. Thanks. That's so sweet. Thank you, Janko. Janko, Janko. Can you teach me a recipe? Hey. Potato fruit or bamboo papaya? Let's do the bamboo papaya. Seafood paella. Paella. Okay. Sounds good. Thank you. Jingle jingle. Alright, horsey. <laughs> Scrappies, I'm so sorry. I have sucked on giving freaking gifts today. All right, we've got 15 welding rods. Switch that back over. You know what? I might do. Because we're okay on carbon steel right now. For now. Um, what are we low on? I could pump up the bronze. I might do that. Yeah. Oh, I'm not, wait. Well, yeah, these are just useless. Switch these over to copper. How are we on charcoal? No, we'll do some stone brick. All right, so. Did I need... Um, it's 23 hours. I need to do one more in there. Okay. What about you guys? Marble plank, wooden board. Wooden boards. Just so we can have them if we need them. Um, yeah, sure. 23 hours, one hour and ten. And you. Let's go ahead and make the iron the planks. And we can't make those because we don't have the we're going to electric furnace, composite wooden boards. We will need some of those, but I want to get my iron wood plank up to 
about 20 or 30. Alright. Alright. Um, we will make, yep, because of, we're going to make some DD stops. One of these days, I'm going to remember. And we're going to make some DD stops and place them around. Um, couple of wire, good. So they're good on that stuff. Alright. Alright. I turned in the shell necklace. I saw all of this. That's gifts. Well, that actually is a gift. I just don't like to use... Well, I mean, you can. One of the Hulus likes those, and I don't... I don't remember. I think it's the one we're going to see tomorrow, woo or whatever, but I can't remember and I don't like giving out stuff that I don't remember. Is that the large planter box? I'm going to hold on to that because we have two over here already. Um, I did check my mail, did I not? Yeah, otherwise there'd be an envelope on it. Alright. Alright. I'll go up here and wop with the rest of my energy. And get some of these beautiful wood. Go up there. Attention. Um, we ordered new guests. We ordered some fur. Do I want to catch a llama llama? I have the lettuce and the cumin. Go engine Maybe, but. Not right now. Well, I mean, uh, let's go see what it takes to make that trap. And it's under here. Let's see if one of those. Go grab my lettuce and my <coughs> cumin. Or cumin, whatever people call it. I think that's enough, I don't remember. Alright. Yeah, alright, let's place it. Choose the appropriate feed to attract the animal and make taming easier. When the timer counts down, the animal will be tamed successfully if you reach the passing mark. When the yellow circle and the button are at the same place, yellow circle and button, press the button to increase the score. Yeah, I don't know what any of that means. Alright. Horsey? Whatever. my horse. And you should go back. 
Let's see. Here. There's some wheat for ya. Food and farming, that and that should go in there. The rest of you guys should, yeah. I'm ready. And that will be it. Can I make more of these? What's that max capacity? Oh, no problem. Alright. You gonna go to sleep? Should I hold on? Let me see how long this video. Yeah, this one's gonna be a long one. So I guess what we'll do is just call this one a video. If you guys ended up enjoying the video, please hit the like button, and if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe. And I will see you all on the next video. Bye.